Hello well, viewers, so I thought I'd take a more detailed look at the uh, Forza coverage that we've seen so far. So here's a look uh, here at the uh, Major Nelson coverage that was released earlier in the week. Uh, yeah, a glimpse of things to come. Uh, they mentioned a big Forza blower actually, but we've not seen so much of it yet. We are looking forward to seeing a bit more. Forza 4 is going to be huge and we're going to have a big presence at E3. There's not a lot I can talk about right now outside of groundbreaking Xbox Live features and Kinect integration. That sensor was a boon for us. We were able to prototype new ideas, some for the core, some for the more casual, and everything for car lovers. But we're always looking for new ways to experience cars. And this was one of those things with head tracking we thought we could bring a new experience for core racers. So we watched how people drove with a controller, with a wheel, and watched how they move their head when they get excited, how they lean into the corners. And we thought Connect would be a great way to just capture that movement they have and allow them to look into the corner. The cool thing is you don't have to wear a helmet or any sort of hat or anything like that. It just works. And it just works with the natural way you play. So Dan doing his thing there. Um, the pedals, they just made me laugh straight away. You know, we have the most advanced setups here at Turn 10 to test all the ultimate gaming experiences. Uh, the definition of driving as the pedals move around a bit. I had to look at that a couple more times. But it, it referred to a major blowout um, of information of news. And we haven't really seen all that yet. Let's have pedals again. I had, I had to just laugh at that moment. It was just comical the way it was set up you know a demonstration of connect you know fantastic and so we hark back now to the original trailer and um, here it is you know it's from this we get all those glimpses a bit like people who analyze the modern warfare 2 trailer when you just heard the sound it was the same here you know you're seeing locations you're seeing cars you're seeing involvement you know what can connect do is it connect for driving or is connect for pit stops where you change the tires which they showed on one of the early demos is connect for changing pointing at parts of the car and changing parts of the car or cleaning the car or whatever it's always peripheral isn't it but it's it's supposed to envelop it but here we are a bit of music yeah um, we've seen off-road there we've seen driving in the snow we've seen test tracks we've seen drag racing we've seen details of cars so this is what we're expecting to find again the off-road is interesting, you know, because that refers Experience. to off-road action. We're stunning graphics scenes, and details are coupled with wild again. innovation and fun. Where casual racers find a place to play with cars, and future pros learn the trade. Where the ultimate car community finds its home for all things automotive. This is our vision for the future of racing. Today, I'm proud to show you Forza Motorsport 4. So, Forza 4 at the show, and again it was a very brief demonstration, it didn't talk too much about the game, circuits, cars, uh, what the game's going to be like to play or anything like that, um, what's really sort of new about it, I know somebody mentioned they thought it was an F1 but that's actually a Le Mans car there, um, but obviously detail of the cars is immense, I think the size of the package will be immense and we'll look forward to some more information. I did get a fact sheet somewhere from Microsoft, but it was very much again, you know, genre defining graphics and detail of the cars you know nothing peripheral stuff nothing that's really all about how it's going to physics systems or how it's going to play or what new modes there's going to be in the game or will they put decent online lobbies into this version you know that's something which I think that they failed on quite badly last time I remember I took a, a Forza expert along with me to an early preview and he basically found all the problems from Forza 2 and Forza 3 with half an hour's play and it's you do wonder sometimes why they don't get a few more racing game obsessives in there to uh, test some of this stuff out. But lots of detail. We see the UK there, bit of Top Gear. The best track in the world. Uh, so, looking good. You know, as I say, we saw some of that on our other videos. Uh, and again, some of it was leaked earlier this year. 16 player races, wow. I mean, that's going to be uh, pretty immense on Forza. I expect it will have a fantastic frame rate and all the rest of it. Hopefully not too laggy. And of course, next we're on to these screenshots now, which are all these clips I showed you yesterday. And again, it was mentioned to me that it, well, it's not real graphics. Well, it is. It is real time. I mean, uh, real time is not pre-rendered. Uh, it doesn't matter if it's in photo mode or if it only moves at one frame a second. Uh, the fact is that it's it is what it is in in the way it runs and. Uh, you know, there's, the detail is just immense on these car models. Obviously, in the in the racing, it won't be nearly as detailed as this, but no doubt it still look fantastic. And we've got the car sounds now. Here we go. Car sounds.
it doesn't give you much to go on, does it? And again. So, uh, either way, graphically, sound-wise, it's going to sound perfect. But uh, we will endeavour to bring you all the information. We'll try and get a few words with Dan if he'll give us the time. We've got a camera guy on the show floor. He's going to try hunting around and he'll say hello to Dan. Hello, Dan, <laughs> if he sees these videos. Um, and uh, we'll bring you more information when we've got it. So just going over those screenshots again. If we get more screenshots, we'll bring them to you. If we get more trailers and footage, we'll bring them to you. And we'll be covering loads more information in the next few months. Finally, the uh, Ferrari 458 Italia is at the show. So I got one of my guys to just take a quick photo of it last night. Uh, looking lovely. Nobody protecting it either. Fantastic. So that's uh, Forza 4 info for now. And as we get more, uh, I'll bring it to you guys. See you soon.